hello welcome to today's video today we're making simple pan fried beef i hope you enjoy you will need beef cut into cubes and some onions then let's begin add some salt into your beef followed by curry powder then mixed spices after which you're going to mix completely until everything is well combined just as mine is Add some oil in a pan, a non-stick pan will be the best. Then we're going to heat the oil until it's very hot. Swirl the oil around the pan to ensure that no meat will get stuck once you start cooking. This is how hot we want our pan to be. At this point we're now going to add our beef. Remember do not reduce the heat because we don't want the meat to get stuck on the pan. Remember to distribute the beef around the pan to avoid them clumping together for even cooking. Once you've added all your beef, do not stir. Let it cook the way it is. At this point, if you have garlic powder, feel free to add it in. If not, you can still use the fresh garlic, it's still okay. Then stir. Thank you for watching until this far. Kindly consider subscribing for more content like this, where you get to cook simple meals with locally found ingredients that you can simply do at the comfort of your home very fast, very easy once the water is completely dried up stop stirring, save the dish and leave it to cook just the fat and how to eat after about one and a half minutes stir so that you don't get burned since they already have burned we enable the other side to also start browning and then we're going with our onions add all your onions in you can add as many or as little as you want then stir to ensure that they cook together now with the meat and also infuse the flavors together Have you subscribed? If you want to crunch your onions, you can remove them at this point if they are done. Otherwise, you can continue cooking until the onions are completely softened. I like to add barbecue sauce to my beef. It also adds another flavor. However, feel free to use any sauce that you have that is to your liking. It can be pepper sauce or sweet and sour sauce. For me, I prefer barbecue sauce. Then mix, 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 stir until everything is well combined. At this point, you can also add any herbs of your liking, like coriander leaves, parsley, or cilantro. Just the heat will be the one that will cook them and we are done and serve and enjoy with your favorite accompaniment.
thank you for watching until this far kindly remember to subscribe like comment share i will really appreciate it and also turn on the notification bell so that you're notified whenever we post enjoy and come again thank you